I see you, Jake. Welcome, bud. Welcome, welcome. Let's see if anybody else joins here, and then uh, I'll get started. I wanted to let you know because you were uh, having issues earlier. You said so. Wanted to make sure you got in there, sir. Hey Tech, what's going on bud? Hello Beer, uh, I'm not even going to try to pronounce that uh, the rest of them. Is that Beer Doggy Dog? I, I think that's how it is. <laughs> how you say that? How's it going? I don't want to slaughter your name. Are you still at the computer shop there, uh, Tech? Okay, cool. All right. What's going on, Rob? Welcome back. Welcome back. Gotcha. Been busy today at all? Yeah, okay. Going home in about an hour. Yeah, the wife should be home getting off work here uh, soon. Very soon. Well, that's good. That's good. All right, we'll give it a little bit longer here and see if anybody else joins. And if not, then uh, we'll go ahead and get started uh, with this thing. All right, so first off, what are we doing? We are building this right here. That's what we're building. What we're gonna start building, that is. It's got lighted engines, lighted cockpit area. Um, it's got a little sit down area that's lighted. lights in the front headlight so I mean it's this one's gonna be pretty cool this one's gonna be really fun to do so. there's supposed to be a blueprint too somewhere but maybe I don't have that yet maybe that comes later
Also, too, um, just to let you guys know, uh, I uploaded the other two, the one from last night, the Ecto-1 that I started last night, and the four issues of the Ecto-1 that I uh, did this morning, or this afternoon. Uh, if you missed the stream onto my YouTube page, make sure you subscribe. Still looking for that thousand subs. We're nowhere close, so hopefully we can get there at some point. I need to get some of this stuff out here because I'm more likely going to maybe need it. Hey Josh, what's going on bud? Alright, so uh, I don't think anybody else is coming. Uh, Josh just joined. Um, so we're going to go ahead and... Uh... Hmm. Start. That way it doesn't go too too late tonight. Cause also too, I mean, at some point I'm gonna have to start cooking dinner. This one looks like it's going to be pretty quick. So, all right. Well, went to go start and all of a sudden, uh, two people dropped out. Okay. <laughs> That's interesting. Okay. No biggie. No big deal. Not the end of the world. This isn't for everybody. did this wrong. I should have pulled it off like this. I believe. Instead of the way I did. <laughs> right. Okay, 
Okay, so right now, we're going to need this. And this. For right now. And I need that. All right. So it looks like what we're going to do, part one, is the rear cockpit instrument panel, um, which is uh, this right here. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to remove the... Uh, backing off of it. Yeah, it goes on the smooth side. Remove the backing off of it and place it onto the uh, other piece. This piece here. Hey, babe. You on your way home, I'm guessing? Also, too, when we go back to work, um, there's no guarantee on this, but I may be doing a parade in Daytona. There is no guarantee on this yet, so... If I do do the parade, I will try to stream it. So that's that right there on that piece. And then uh, This is just a test fit right now. It's not permanent, but that's what it's kind of going to look like, like that. Um, this piece here will be backlit with LEDs. So we'll set that aside there. And the next one that we're going to do is going to be the cannon that's on the uh, 
ship. Again, I wish I had an airbrush kit because I would love to do some weathering and stuff and make this stuff look more realistic. Paint this because the gun on the Millennium Falcon was not silver. It was uh, white like the firearm and then it was kind of black at the ends. And I'd like to take a drill and drill out these ends right here and stuff like that. But Maybe later. All right. So it looks like what we need is these here. Got four of them. I don't know if I need all four. These are different. They don't actually have the names like um, the other uh, um, the Ecto One and the DeLorean. So it's just pretty much they show you what the screw looks like, and that's the screw you're supposed to use. So, but let me test fit the. Uh, thing here and that's not going to work that's too big so let's take it once to the small one and that should be perfect all right So what it looks like is it wants us to do is it wants me to take this and one of these pieces So basically, it'd be like this. Take that. Then it wants me to take this other one. And fit this one. Oops. And then... Did that backwards. That's why it didn't look right.
Yeah, this one's um, uh, the Millennium Falcons by Diagostini. Um, they have a UK base. It base is what it where it is, but they have a US one and in Tennessee, and when you change the pricing to you United States, it takes you to the US page. Um, the other one is Eagle Moss. Um, they're based in the UK also, but they, um, they have a US based page also. This is a little, little finicky here, so bear with me here if I'm not really talking. I'm trying to get this to fit. Alright. And then about the airbrush, no. All right, so there's that. That's pretty cool. So that'd be done there on that one. I'm gonna have to get me a marker and mark the gold on those. So that's issue uh, one done <laughs> on that one like I said I mean that one wasn't gonna take very long there's a few other pieces 
that um, are in uh, issue two. I mean, not issue two, but uh, in this package or this first issue, but um, we're not going to mess with them right now. Um, so that one's done there. Now let's move on to the next one. Right here, top of me. front of me. All right. Yeah, the the uh, Millennium Falcons kind of pricey. Um, at first, uh, it, it is a little bit more expensive than what Eagle Moss is to start. Eagle Moss, I mean, you can start your stuff at like a dollar something for Eagle Moss. Um, the Millennium Falcon, I think it's 64, and I think to start it was like 7 something. 7.99. It was 7.99 to start, so there we go. So what we're going to have here is we're going to have... I got a present for you. Looks like, what's that? Something from Eagle Moss. Oh. Hey, guys. <laughs> I think I might have the DeLorean's second parts. We'll see. I got it. Oh. Before you leave, you get to throw all your toys. Yes, I know. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. Maybe I do need it. I sharpened it, so. <laughs> and you're going to let me... But they haven't charged us yet. I don't know. I didn't know anything else. Unless this is the first shipment of the Ghostbuster that was originally supposed to be here. Yes, it's the first shipment of the Ghostbusters. <laughs> so it's the it's the one that was supposed to be here. I don't know if this was the one that was supposed to be here. Or the reship. Or the reship. <laughs> That's funny. Oh, no, this is the reship. That's the reship. The one you got is the original because it original. says, Enclosed our Ghostbusters Echo 1 build-up replacement items you requested. Uh, well, I got extra screws, so. <laughs> you got extra parts. Yeah, I got extra parts. Yeah, with this whole Corona stuff, COVID deal, um, things weren't moving, and they did a reship on my issue one. Well, I we thought they were doing it because it was lost. Well, I got the original, and I just received the reship. So, <laughs> now I got extra parts, and I have a whole new hood and all that stuff. Maybe I'll do a giveaway and, you know, maybe uh, give somebody the hood and stuff if they want to do it. Um, we'll see. What? I can't remember if they were going to reship 3 through 6 too. I don't think they were. Because I called them about it because it hadn't been shipped either. Huh. I uh, <laughs> That's funny. So in this issue here, we're going to have uh, some parts to put together in this one. It's not going to be as quick as just this and that. Um, you know, the, the gun, turret, and then the, the little doohickey here. Uh, let's see here. So we're going to have black bottom, head, screw, fixed frame, selection. Then I'm going to have a brass screw. They're used to assemble the cannons and radial frames. And then I have brass uh, three millimeter. Um, which message? Um, 
I need to make you a VIP, Josh, or, uh, uh, Rob. Um. Hang on a second. Be